Hi everybody, Frank here with a guitar tutorial for you all. Um, uh, I haven't done one of these for a little while and I think since I last did one of these we have put out the West Coast versus Wessex split uh, with no effects, uh, of which I'm very proud, one of my favourite bands growing up and um, from whom I learned a lot about songwriting. Um, obviously part of the point of the split was to find different ways of playing their songs, so um, and we're going to talk about the song Bob today, the original um, classic bit of uh, uh, old school pop punk. Uh, from no effects from the mid 90s um uh, i've always thought the lyrics kind of had a kind of mal haggard vibe to them and it's sort of so i wanted to try and find a way of playing it as a country song so there's a lot of um, country chords in this um it's not a super hard song to play but there's a there's some neat little tricks in there which can which can come in handy so we're in the key of g we're in standard tuning we have no capo um so i'm going to start by playing a g chord and i'm, I'm actually playing it um uh with my ring finger on the third fret of the bottom string, and then I'm blocking the A string with that, and I've got my little finger on the third fret of the top string. So it's a G major chord, and the reason I'm playing it like that is so I can uh, move to my next chord position. Um, which is, uh, it's, a, it's a real traditional kind of folk and country chord thing. I was chatting with someone the other day, so they weren't familiar with this, so that it's uh, Bob Dylan uses all the time, loads of country singers, it's, it's a great uh, little trick to know. So using that G position, all you're gonna do is using your middle finger on the second fret of the D string, and your first finger on the first fret of the B string. And you'll recognize that as kind of a C major chord, except that you're fretting the uh, third fret of the bottom string, not the A string. So it's kind of a C over G. And with, with your fingers in that position, you can very happily do that. And then, of course, you can um, also with the middle finger, you can hit the second fret on the G string like that. So the, those are your three uh, chords in the intro, uh, and indeed the verse. So um, and it's in a it's in a swung feel in a in a three four time. So. is the implication and that's the verse the intro and the verse um, uh, verses plural uh, there's kind of a, a, a chorus section um, where it goes from the goes from a G which I tend to play as a G5 so I've got third fret on the B string there as well to a D to E minor, to C, like that. Just tune this time a bit. Uh, and then there's the only other section, there's a weird transitional chord which is, it uh, goes to a B7, yeah, which is uh, not playing the bottom string, and then it's 2, 1, 2, open 2. And then I, I this is an addition that I made to the song, and then goes to a, a C minor, again a traditional sort of country turnaround. There. Um, and then finally the end section, um, the play out. Um, uh, so if you start again with that original G position with your ring finger and your little finger, and then you can go to an F shape. So what you're going to do is you're going to use your thumb over the top to press the first fret and block the A string, and then you've got three, two, one, uh, three, two, one, but you've still got that high G on the top of the third fret of the top E string and then to a C, and then to a D, so. At the end there, playing a, a D sus four, so it keeps that high note kind of powering through it like a sort of top line drone. Um, and those are the chords, so it's pretty easy. Um, a lot of it's about the feel in your right hand. That's really important for the song to give it that kind of shuffly country feel. Um, but the whole song, which incidentally features a very high bit at the end, so I'm going to give this a go. Uh, the whole song sounds like this. Spent 15 years getting loaded
doctor said What you been thinking about and Bob said That's the point Don't want to think about nothing now I've got to do something else To pass the time Had someone shave his head You got a new identity Harmonica solo here on my version, a trumpet one and no effects. I'm back to the verse. A couple of lines, an extra thermos of Joe. Up the kicking in heads at the punk rock show. As Bob's the kind of guy who knows just what. Bob's the kind of guy who knows just what to do. When the doctor tells him. You're drinking, now's the time But will he ever walk the line? To all my friends I feel just fine But will he ever walk the line? Will he ever walk the line? Will he ever walk the line? Will he ever That's real high. I think it's a high D at the end there. But anyway, there it is. What a wonderful song. Nice work, Mike and the boys. I'm writing that. That's my version of it. Um, and uh, you can listen to the original. You can listen to mine. But now you can play mine more easily. Thanks very much.